Okay, here is a parallelogram. Work out the value of x and the value of y. So a parallelogram, well, it's got parallel lines. And we need to know the relationship between the angles in a parallelogram. So the opposite ones in a parallelogram, this one and this one, they are the same. They are equal to each other. So we can use that. Or any two angles next to each other, they're co-interior, so they add up to 180 degrees. We can use either one of those. We're going to use both. So we're going to do this blue one first. So we're going to say 5x minus 20 is equal to 2x plus 43. So we're going to solve the equation. The first step, we're going to get rid of the smallest x. So I've got 5x's here, 2 x's on the other side. So if I take 2 x from both sides, I'm going to get rid of the smallest x. So that will leave me with 3 x minus 20 is equal to 43. I'm going to get rid of the minus 20 now to get x by itself. And I'm going to add 20 to both sides to do that. So that leaves me with 3 x is equal to 63 and then 3x is a 63 to get x by itself i'm going to divide by 3 so divide by 3 divide by 3 and that leaves me with 21 so x is 21 now i'm going to work out i'm going to use these co-interior angles now so we've got um five x minus 20 add 4y minus 5x is equal to 180. So I'm going to collect the like terms and I've got 5x minus 5x which is actually nothing. So that leaves me with just minus 20 plus 4y equals 180. I'm going to plus 20 to both sides to get the y's by themselves. So plus 20 plus 20 that leaves me with 4y is equal to 200. So 4y is a 200. Divide both sides by 4. So y is 50. And that's the answer. So x is 21, y is 50.